مجمع الأندلس التعليمي تعلم عصري ملهم بهوية وطنية وقيم إسلامية Hello my students and welcome to our first online learning lesson for this week uh, Sunday the 27th of September 2020 Our lesson today is mainly about vocabulary and reading so open your students to page 22 and follow the lesson with me. Okay, now let's start our lesson. The first part of our lesson today is vocabulary. We are going to learn the meaning and the usages of certain vocabulary items. Okay, so the first word to be learned today is, yes, our first word today uh, to be learned is come out of a mother's body you when you come out of your mother's body means you were born to be born my brother was born on the 13th of july born be born was or were born he was born on the first of march be born Ulida. Our second word is learn to move. To learn to, to move alone means learn to walk. My sister learned to walk at the age of one. When she was one year, year old, she learned to walk. Learn to move means learn to walk. Then go to school for the first time. Start school. We usually start our school on the 1st of September. Start school. Kids start school at the age of, of six. Start school. Kids go to school for the first time. Right after that, Study after secondary school. When you finish your secondary school studies, you go to the to university. Go to university, or in other words, we can say to join the university. Join the university. My brother joined the university after finish after finish after finishing schooling. When he finished uh, his secondary school study, studies. He joined or he went to the university. Joined or went. So, go to school or go to the university means you finish your high school or secondary school studies. Finish university. When you finish all your studies at the university, this time, by this time, you uh, graduate. Graduate from the university. You graduate from the university and got a high degree certificate. Graduate from the university. Right after that, find work to get money. When you find a, a certain work to get money, uh, this refers to getting a job. You get a job. This means that you get a job to support yourself get a job when my when my brother finished his his high school studies he he got a job when my brother graduated from the university he got a job at qnb got a job so got in the past from get get a job find work to get money Look at that wonderful picture. Find a husband or a wife to live with. Get married. When you find your, your, your wife or a certain wife to live with, this means that you get married. Get married. Congratulations. Okay? So, have children. Have a children means to start your family, to start a new family and have children. St 
stop working because you are old. When you are old enough, you stop working. Retire and grow old. Stop work, st when you stop working uh, since you are old, this refers to being, uh, to being an elderly human being. Or you retire and grow old. Retire at taqa'ud wal-kibar aw shaykhukha. Bilug sin at taqa'ud. Now, after you have learned the new words of today's lesson, I recommend you to use these words in complete sentences of your own. أبنائي العزاء بعدما استمعنا إلى هذه المفردات وشرحها ينبغي عليكم أن تضعوها في جمل مفيدة. Okay, so this time we are going to use or to practice you using these words or the synonym of these words in meaningful contexts. Okay. Or find the synonym. Synonym يعني مترادفات هذه الكلمة. Okay. Now the first, uh, the first, uh, the first part of the lesson or the first phrase is be born. To be born means yes. To be born means uh, yes. To be born means to learn, uh, to learn to walk. Start uh, uh, to learn to walk. Start school. Yes, start school, uh, finish school, start school and finish school. Uh, you have to look at the timeline with different life events and complete the gaps from one to four, or the phrases A to, to D below. Right, the third one, yes, go to university. Number four, start a family. Now, I want you to practice using these, the, 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 these words. Look at the list of words on the top of the exercise and fill in the gaps with the correct ones. The first one is drive, job, school, retire, walk, born, graduated, get married. Number one, I was space on the 14th of November. Yes, right? I was, right, I was born. I was born on the 14th of November. This is your path there. You were born on the 14th of November. Number two, I learned it, I learned it too, and got a driving license. I learned it too, yes, I learned it too, to drive. I learned it to drive. Excellent. Number three, I'm looking for a good wife. I want, when you look for a good wife, this means that you want to, yes, to, to get married, to get married. You want to get married and have a children. Congratulations, okay? When I become 60 years old, I wanted to, yes, to retire, stay at home, rest, and enjoy the rest part of your life. Retire, retire at the cloud. التقاعد. أود التقاعد. Okay. I finished my study at university and finally, yes, graduated. Graduated from the university. تخرجت من الجامعة. I started when I was six years old. When you were six old years old, you start your yes, school. Kids go to school at the age of six. So you start school at the age of, of six. I started school when I was six years old. Number seven, my mother helped me to and, and take my first lesson. Yes, to? Correct. To walk. Excellent. To walk and take your first steps. It is very important to get, a, to get money. A, a job. A job. Right. Excellent. Now, let's go to the second part of our lesson. And before going to the second part of the lesson, I want you to discuss with, you, with your, with your uh, parents, with your uh, mother, uh, with your sisters, with your sibling, these questions. 
you can ask them, them these questions. Since we are not in the classroom and you, you don't have time to discuss uh, these questions with your teacher, so I recommend you to discuss these questions with your parents, your father, mother, and sister. Okay, number one, at what age can people start school? Yes, and at what age can, can people learn to drive? Finally, at what age can you get a job or retire? Right, you can, you can discuss these questions with, with members of your family. Now, my students, uh, we have the second part of a lesson today and the remaining part of exercise that's, that's in the reading task, okay? But before going through the reading, look at these, the, these new vocabulary items as well. We've gone through the phrases. Now, look at number one, nuts. This picture shows different kinds of nuts. Do you like eating nuts? I do. I like eating nuts regularly. Okay, classmates. Classmates is the person you study at the same class with. Classmates, Zumala et Drasa. Yes, what's this guy doing? Yes, look how happy he is. That's why he is, yes, he is laughing, laugh, laugh, yes, when you are happy. When people feel happy, they usually laugh at certain jokes, laugh. Yes, present. Present means gift. Do you like being given presents or gift? Yes. Have you ever received a gift from, from your parents? Present. This is a present. Okay. Now this is a driveway, driveway, driveway. Now look at these movements. Stunt, stunt. Next, skate park. People are practicing skating at the skate park, skate park. Yes, and this is the skateboard that people used to, to skate with. Skateboard. This is a skateboard. Now, look at this animal and tell me, what is it doing? Yes, right. It is chewing. It is chewing certain vegetables. Look at the movement of, of, his, uh, of its mouth. And is it chewing certain uh, vegetables? or certain food. I don't know what, what food it is chewing, but it, uh, it's chewing, I, I, it, could be, it, it could be chewing grass, right? Now, my students, uh, open your book on page uh, no, 22. Uh, we've gone through most of these vocabulary items. It's your turn to read and choose the best title for the blog, uh, uh, then answer uh, certain uh, questions on exercise B, okay? Uh, I recommend you to skim and scan these, uh, this, th these paragraphs in order to find the answer to these questions. ليس بالضرورة أن نفهم كل كلمة علينا أن نقوم بعمل skimming أي مطالعة البحث عن الفكرة الرئيسية skimming means reading fast to find the main idea نقرأ بسرعة عشان نعرف الفكرة الرئيسية then scanning يعني reading fast to find specific information القراءة السريعة لكي نبحث عن معلومة محددة في النص ليس بالضرورة أن نفهم كل كلمة نفهم المعلومات المقصودة أو المستهدفة من السؤال okay so this is the task and this is a blog about Henry Henry's blog مدونة Henry مدونة مكتوب على الانترنت. Okay, you can read this uh, this uh, text, you can read this blog, and try to answer these questions. This blog is in, in your students book page 22, uh, exercise two, reading. You have to read and choose the best uh, answers uh, for the blog. Okay, now let's have a look at the question. Read, read and write true 
for true answers and false for false ones. Right? Now, number one, Henry lost his first tooth at home. Is it true or false? Yes? Think for a few seconds and tell me. Yes? Correct. False. Right. False. It is false. Number two, Henry bit on a knot and lost his tooth. Right? False. Number three, when Henry lost his tooth, he told the other students. Correct. Right. True. Henry got his first skateboard a year ago. Right? True. Henry's parents gave him the skateboard. Yes, false. False. Henry got the skateboard. When Henry got the skateboard, he went to the skate park with his friends. Right, false. Henry knows how to do a lot of skateboarding stunts. Yes, right, true. By this, we come to the end of our lesson today. Thank you for listening and watching, and have a good day.